you can go and hide yourself whenever you know feeling blue we agree to host this charity cycling event with them for Daraja to raise for them funds your little donation your big donation it all makes a difference to us because when you're educating this one girl you are actually empowering an entire community through Daraja I know that my dreams are valid and I know that one day one time I'm going to fulfill it Raja Girls uh, came across it when we moved into Mayan and it was just the idea that there was a school in the community that was not only educating but also adding values to the girls. It was a value-based education and when I got to visit there uh, immediately we were like we want a partner because it's in the community because we believe that wherever we go it's important to add value to the community. Daraja has really helped me because I come from a place that education is like uh, nothing. I've also managed to meet many girls from different communities all over Kenya and I've learned even to live with peace with the communities that most of them in our community they believe that we living with them in peace is like a taboo and that's what the Pokot. So I've learned that Life is about helping each other and living in peace with everybody around you. Being a girl who grew up in a community which still be, believes in some of its archaic culture, it, has been, it, ha, it was not that easy to, to go to a high school, but the Raja was there, it has helped me, and now I'm there continuing with my high school. At a point I could not tell what next of life, but because of somebody who decided to pay my school fees, somebody who decided to support me, I was able to get to where I am right now. So the Raja girls are really an inspiration. And this event, how it works is that when people come for a common goal, like cycling and a family party, you can come all out together, sports enthusiasts, cycling enthusiasts, people who are just friends of the Raja, spend a day together, get to experience the girls one more, once more here, how is it developing? How can we be part of it? And I believe that me being an alumni and be able to also help the Raja also sports a child, a girl, and make their future bright like mine was made bright. And I'll be able to help the girls, not only by not only financially, but also by mentorship, mentally and physically and also emotionally. Deciding to support a girl that it takes a very good heart to remove your money to support a girl and i would li really like to thank you and continue with the same spirit and i promise you that god one day will come and bless you abundantly hosting it at mayan for us was an honor Raja at the inception and yes I met the first class of girls when they were joining the Raja. It is interesting to say the first meeting when we were making the timetable we didn't have a chalk. Mr. Charles do you remember? We did not have a piece of chalk. It was a walk of fame. Around the table was Mr. Charles, myself, Jason and Jenny, the founders of the school, and we did the timetable using pens and we said we will get a piece, I mean a, a packet of chalks when we go to town, because what was more important was putting the whole process on paper to know that we have girls that are coming to school and we need to support them like we are the most experienced school there can be. This is a journey we've been to work together because Kenya needs us. Kenya needs us. My dear, Kenya needs us. I have walked around, I have sat with girls, and I know they're boys, and we are not at the level we think we are in terms of transition from primary school to secondary school. There is a lot that we can do together. The idea is a bridge. And somebody explained this people. When we all come together, the bridge is always stronger. So I am so excited to see
see and learn how together we can raise this generation that is born by us. They are ours. And we have done it. We're going to do it with you. Have you ever been invited to a ball and you say yes before they finish? Are you open to say yes? yes. <laughs> you want to hear the chant? Yes! <laughs> because when you visit the Raja, and for those who haven't gone there, this is just a bit of experiencing what the Raja is like. When you get there and you see what happens at the Raja, with what they have, with the excellence, the values and the commitment, it just has something in your heart and you're just like i want more of this actually just not only in the raja if every school system in kenya had the same values the same support structure they give to this girl because sometimes you may get the academic but you cannot receive it because of all the limitations or the challenges you face they actually bring these girls and show them that you are more than your circumstances. And they do it with such love, such care and commitment, showing up every single day. A group of such amazing teachers speak the same song, that I am the Raja. Can I hear us say that? I am the Raja. Thank you for taking part in being the Raja. And I look forward to working with you. Thank you.